Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, choosing to lead a healthier lifestyle is often easier said than done. Constantly being on the go and always craving that delicious extra helping at lunch, we tend to veer away from our plans. Ask me, I'm an expert of it. Our friends at NutriBullet want you or want to inspire viewers to take on the challenge and transform and, of course, transformation, of course, um, of leading a healthy lifestyle. Today in the loft, we have health and fitness consult, a consultant and trainer, Zintle Nchikila, to tell us more about her personal journey of transformation and how she became the fit and fabulous and healthy person that she is today. Zintle, welcome to Afternoon Express. Thank you for having me, Jenny. Now, you are my new fitspiration because, wow, this lady is remarkable. Why don't you tell us about your amazing transformation? Wow, <laughs> where do I start? <laughs> uh, the beginning, when you, when you felt like, okay, things have got to change. It's after I had my second baby, mm -hmm. which is, she's four years old now. And I was just basically sick of being judged on how I look and uncomfortable. And the fact that I'm exactly the same age with my husband, just, I just felt like an aunt. But yeah. most importantly, when I wanted to do it for everyone else, it didn't work. Exactly. It just had to hit me. Yeah. And that's when it, I began, I was like, I'm, I'm tired of this. Yeah. And I think, um, I don't know, after the kids, I, d I don't know when. And then I went to the JNB Med and I was insisting on this boob tube dress. And my mom's like, you in no size of wearing a boob tube dress. But you know when you're in denial and it's only after I went there and then I looked at the pictures, I'm like, how did it I get there? It wasn't you. Was it like you, you were in a different body? In yes. Different business body? How did I let myself? How yeah. did I get there? Because I was comfortable in my size 38, 40. I've never been a slim Skinny kind girl. of girl. And I was, okay, jeans. You know how you justify, um, I'm already this big, let me might as well. So yeah. I continued to eat. I continued, I hated gym with all my life. Really? My husband has always been a fit fanatic and I would just, I, was, I would not be bothered. And if mm. he goes to gym, I would get annoyed instead. And yeah. after that, I, it, it just had to hit me. And I yeah. thought, okay, I'm tired of this. Let me change. And then that's when I decided, okay, what do I do? I've done it so many times, fell off the wagon. Like, I, I, I lived on diets. Like, yeah. everything on the shelf. And I was like, okay, what do I do? Amazing. And then I started a journal. And like, okay, what got me here? And then I wrote down everything that got me there and um, where do I want to go and write down my thoughts, how I conquered the first week, second week. Whenever that weak moment comes, I would go back to my journal. I would cry, literally cry between a craving. Like I, would, I wouldn't know how I got to you know, take away, drive through um, Kentucky. I would hold my, like my journal was with me 24 seven. It was a pocket, in, like I would, because I deprived myself of going out as well. Because if, if I go out, I get tempted. But that's a lot of discipline. How it did was. you stay focused? Like, I, I'm, I'm just so determined. That then journal is think, creased. Oh, that. Yeah. Because it was me and the tears and the craving. Yeah. Like, who wins? I've, I've given up before. Am yeah. I going to do it again? Mm. What do, it's, it's, it's starting all over again. Yeah. So I just want to get back to you. You said that you were so unhappy with what you looked like. I want you to paint a picture for the audience of what you looked like. I was a whooping size 46. Yeah. G size bra. Yeah. And wearing, um, weighing a 106 kilograms. Yeah. So what we've seen now, how much have you lost? 50 Ks. 50 kilograms. 50. That's probably what you weigh. This is why you weigh. It's probably what you weigh. So it's a whole new person. And my mom would say, you put your kids together, they still don't give you 50. So yeah. you can imagine how you, you look like. Yeah. So it was, it took me 18 months to yeah. lose all the weight. And I've been at my goal now for just over two years. Yeah. And I think that's when, then that's when I started my Instagram yeah. because I needed to justify. Like You've I, got so many followers on Instagram. You've got like 65,000 followers or something yes. I checked. So it's all because it's, it's people meal ideas because that's what I thought. I yeah. thought diet was water, chicken breast, boiled chicken breast, and yeah. that Greek salad we all hate. Oh, please tell me it's not that. <laughs> so I just said, okay, I must just find new ways. And exactly. I, never, I never knew that I could cook. 
Yeah. Like... Well, what I love about your Instagram is that so many people now across the world are doing that Kayla Itzinus kind of um, diet in her fitness program. She's never been fit. Uh, she's never been fat in her entire life. She's a skinny young girl that's never had a fat day. Yes. So how can that be your inspiration? I think something like you, because you've been there and lost it all, is amazing. It's so amazing. with your Instagram page, do you offer diets, uh, food suggestions and exercise yes. tips? I, I, I share almost my everyday meals. I share my gym check-ins, and as a mom, as a wife, when do you get the time? If the day has, if the day had 23 hours, you'd make use of that. Yeah. So I don't, um, I'm, I'm, I don't listen to the excuses that I cannot go to gym, I cannot eat healthy, yeah. I cannot pack food, I cannot, all those things. Yeah. So you make means. If you want to, you commit. If you yeah. want to eat healthy, you commit. Yeah. And then food ideas. And then what else? Everything. Like I yeah, share amazing. my lifestyle basically. <laughs> what do I eat when I go out? Exactly. I find alternatives at restaurants. I, I, um, I, I think I enjoy more of the food I cook now than going out. I'm coming I'm so over for dinner. <laughs> I cannot wait. You are definitely my new inspiration. Thank you so much Thank for coming you. through. I think you're going to be on the show. We're going to see a lot more of you. Yes. So why not you? Why don't you take on the challenge today of transforming your life? All you need to do is visit NutriBullet.co.za for inspiration and start that Nutri living today. In the upcoming weeks, we, along with NutriBullet, want to help inspire and motivate you. We have some really exciting tips coming your way and fascinating people to bring you. After the break, it's time for Winner Home on Afternoon Express. We'll be right back. How are you doing, YouTube fam? Thank you so much for watching, sharing, and commenting. We love hearing from you, so be sure to keep up to date with all things Afternoon Express by clicking the subscribe button right here.